हेलो स्टूडेंट्स गुड टाइम टू ऑल आई एम चंदन कुमार प्रधान वेलकम टू यूर यूट्यूब चैनल चंदन फिजिक्स इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस पार्टीशन फंक्शन लेट्स वेगेन पार्टीशन फंक्शन इज एन इम्पोर्टेंट क्वांटिटी दैट एनकोर्स द स्टैटिस्टिकल प्रॉपर्टीज ऑफ ए सिस्टम एंड दैट अ सिस्टम is thermodynamic equilibrium state is called partition function if we compare uh, in statistical physics with quantum mechanics in case of uh, quantum mechanics we take uh, wave function psi by using that uh, wave function psi we describe uh, the physical properties of that particular system in the same way by using that partition function we can easily describe what are the physical properties of that uh, system provided the condition that that uh, system is a thermal equilibrium state in the previous video lecture we have already discussed about maxwell boltzmann distribution law according to maxwell boltzmann distribution law if we consider a container in which there are ideal gas that ideal gas in equilibrium state so how the energy is distributed among uh, the particles or atoms or molecules whatever uh, it may be that are present inside that of system that can be evaluated by using maxwell boltzmann distribution law from maxwell boltzmann distribution law we obtain the number of particles in that of ith compartment we divide the entire system into k number of compartments or intervals from that of uh, k number of uh, compartments we take in one of the compartment that is the ith compartment where the number of particles let n i so what be the energy of uh, that uh, particular uh, compartment uh, having the particles it is given by ni is equal to gi gi is the number of elementary cells present in that of ith compartment again that ith compartment is divided into gi number of small elementary cells with equal in size divided by e to the power alpha into e to the power beta into ui here alpha and beta are the constants and ui is the mean energy possessed by n i number of particles within that of ith interval these terms we have already discussed in the video lecture named as maxwell boltzmann distribution law we just simplified here n i is equal to g i into e to the power minus alpha into e to the power minus beta into u i u 
e to the power minus alpha as e is a constant alpha is a constant entire term e to the power minus alpha is a constant let e to the power minus alpha is equal to a constant as a so it is written as n i is equal to g i into a into e to the power minus beta into u i the value of beta we put it here as beta is equal to 1 divided by k t where uh, k is the Boltzmann's constant and t be the absolute temperature So, the value of uh, beta now put it in that of expression, we obtain n i is equal to g i into a into e to the power minus u i divided by k t. n i is the number of uh, particles present in the ith compartment and u i is the energy possessed by that number of particles n i present in that of particular compartment. So, the total number of uh, molecules or atoms or uh, particles total number of particles n be the total number of particles n will be summation over i n i so n is equal to summation over i the value of n i g i into a into e to the power minus u i divided by k t a is the constant. So, n is equal to constant outside of that of summation summation over i g i into e to the power minus u i by k t. Now that constant is divided here. So, n divided by a is equal to summation over i g i into e to the power minus u i divided by k t n by a. We define it as the partition function z, which is equal to summation over i g i into e to the power minus u i divided by k t. Here z is called here z is called the partition function. in statistical physics by using that uh, partition function we can easily describe various uh, statistical properties like uh, internal energy gibbs free energy helmholtz energy entropy and so many thermodynamical properties of a particular system can easily understood by using partition function and that partition function 
is only applicable when that the system is in equilibrium state ok. So, here with the help of this video lecture we understand the concept of partition function what the importance of partition function is and we define the partition function by using Maxwell Boltzmann energy distribution law. We take Maxwell Boltzmann energy distribution law by taking ideal gas in equilibrium state. From that uh, expression we define a function z which is equal to summation over g i e to the power minus u i divided by k t that z is called the partition function in statistical physics. So, with this useful and important notes let me wind up the session. Thank you.